Happy Saturday. Happy, happy, happy Saturday. I have the hiccups. And I can't make them go away. I've had the hiccups all day. Like, off and on. All day long. <laughs> all right. Um... I hope you're having a good day. The weather is absolutely beautiful outside. Case wants to go swimming after this. I'm worried it's going to be freezing, but we're going to see what happens. She's a kid. They don't, they're not affected by the cold. All right. We are going to talk Father's Day collection today. Taking a break from three backs. We're going to talk about the Father's Day collection. I have all of the bars and I have the oils. And then I have Jeremy's picks. Because I made him pick. I'm just pulling up the technical scent descriptions because I can't say it smells like a sexy man for every single one of them. Alright, here we go. So everything in the Father's Day collection is still available. So that's good. Oh my god, these stick ups. Alright. So in the Father's Day collection, what. This is going to take forever. All right. In the Father's Day collection were five scents. One brand new one. One that was in the Father's Day collection last year. And then three that used to be all around scents. And then they had left and now they're back. Um, they're all manly scents. They're just really good. So let's start with business casual. Technical description. Cardamom. Caraway, Lively Pepper, Fragrant Woods, and Wispy Orange Blossom. What is Lively Pepper? Is that like a fancy pepper? I don't know what that is. Alright, Business Casual is lighter. Soapy smelling. I hate saying that. I really truly do. You guys know I hate that, but it is a very, like, it does smell like soap. So good at clean it really good bathroom set mm, would be a very good bathroom set so on the lighter side soapy scent I don't smell anything like I don't know what cardamom is I don't know what caraway is I sure the heck don't know what a lively pepper is <gasps> so an orange blossom but yeah it's very it's a very clean scent clean very clean my goodness these hiccups business casual it's available in a bar It is, yeah, I think it's only, yeah, it's only available in a bar or you can do the Father's Day bundle, which is four bars for 20. Me and these hiccups. All right, next one, My Dear Watson. This one is a Jeremy pick. I told him out of all of these, pick the ones that you want me to get forever and ever because he uses more, um, more like these scents in his office at work so I was like which ones would you pick and this one and then sandalwood tangerine are the other is the other one that he picked he said those two for sure so my dear Watson technical description is bergamot refreshing bergamot con contrasted I could not figure out what that word was that's embarrassing contrasted with mint cedar and suede sophisticated and smart I remember when we had this one in the catalog it was very popular very popular in a car bar bolder much more bold than business casual much mintier tiny hint of leather very tiny and you guys know I do not like leather I don't like that but it's it's there just a tiny very and like it sounds dumb but it is a very sophisticated scent it's almost like old books in a leather like almost it's gonna sound dumb you ready it's not it's like what you would picture like a psychologist's office you know the leather couch in the books and a guy sitting there that's what this smells like like an old office that smells amazing Fancy. It smells fancy. Like a fancy architectural digest office. It's good. Like I said, 
my dear Watson, this is one that Jeremy picked to club for sure for him. So that's what he picked. Only available in a bar or add it to your club. Next one is Route 66. The, this is the last one of the ones that were... Um, I don't know. Oh, because it came unplugged there. I was like, why is it not working? Why is my computer not charging? There we go. Alright. Route 66. This is another one that we have had that was in a cat was in the catalog for a while, then left. It gets voted back quite often in bringbacks. A windswept drive in a convertible, exhilarating breeze of citrus, herbs, and musk. That's what this one is. Are you going outside, Case? Okay. This one is different. This one is more like grass smelling. I guess, I guess a little, not a lot, tiny, tiny hint of citrus, not very much. It's more of a grassy, I can smell the musk. It sounds really dumb, but it's like a drive on the ocean. You're going to have that wet, kind of musky, um, just damp smell, but not in a bad way. You know what I mean? Because every, the waves are crashing and you've got the moss kind of deal. So it's going to, it, that's really does what it smells like, but in a good way. Like I say those words cause the, usually those words are like gross words. Like, ew, it's musky. It's not, it's very good. Like cruising down the coast of California. Like this is what I expect it to smell like. I would expect it to smell a little more salty from the salt water. So it's like that minus the salt water, a good, really fresh, fresh scent it's good so so far business casual i would say is the lightest my dear watson is the strongest and then this one i would say is in the middle all are in the relatively clean fresh category i would say um just with a little bit of difference you know what i mean so one is soapy business casual is soapy my dear watson is more deeper um leather sophisticated like sexy like a mysterious man is that one route 66 is outdoorsy earthy um type of scent all really really good they are all really really good i love this collection because i don't think we have enough manly scents and every you don't have to be a man to like these scents you don't these were, are great in the bathroom these are great in the bedroom dude put in one of these sexy man scents and then go have really good dreams just throwing out their helpful life tips from Amber. All right, the next one we're gonna do is Sandalwood Tangerine. This is a brand new scent this season. It is available in a bar, a scent circle, and pods. And then the Father's Day Body Bundle, which is the body wash, the cream shave soap, and the body mist. If you've never tried the cream shave soap, you really truly, what are you doing, Cooks? You truly need to try it. It is amazing. It's really, really good. I don't use it just for the fact that the razor that I use has the um, like the shave, the strips on the top and the bottom, so I don't have to use any shave gel because um, I'm lazy. It's just one last step I have to do. But I have used it. I bought it. I got it. I tried it for you guys a while back when it first came out. It's really good. It smells good, not over the top, but enough. And it's just so moisturizing. So that is in the Father's Day bundle in this sandalwood tangerine scent. This is the other one that Jeremy said to club. So that's his two cents. White cedar, a spritz of tangerine and sandalwood. Ooh. That's herby. Okay, that's the cedar. I'm not good at that. Jeremy's really good. Like, ooh, that smells like this. Like different woods and stuff. But that's because he works with trees. And he used to work with trees and he's back in trees, you know. That's what he went to school for. So he's good at that. He's like, oh, that smells like oak tree. I'm like, well, oh, good. But it does. It's very cedar on the bottom. It's a very earthy bottom. I don't really smell a tangerine. It's not bold. 
by any means tangerine in there, but it's so it is a strong scent, but not like strong scent. You know, it's like I would say a medium. He tries to pick scents for his office because his office is just two desks, and he doesn't want anything to overpower or upset anybody else. So I would say this is kind of a medium strength wise. I still think business casual is the lightest scent so far. Yeah, business casual by far out of this collection is the lightest. And my dear Watson is to me still the strongest. This one is different. It's different than West, the rest of them because of that cedar in there. It would be a good winter scent too. I feel like this would be a very good fall scent. But again, this was My Dear Watson and Sandalwood Tangerine are the two that Jeremy said for sure put in your club. So, if that tells you anything, those were his favorites. Next, um, scent-wise is Vanilla Bourbon. It was the most popular scent last year, and we had two scents um, that came out in the Father's Day collection. I think My Hero was the one, and then this one. I could be wrong. I don't 100% remember, but I think so. And so many of you, Club was fairly new last year around this time, and it was like what made Club blow up because so many of you loved this scent. No joke. Warm vanilla, bourbon, and nutmeg. Okay, I can smell. I, I can. It's kind of bakery kind of bakery it's kind of a kind of bakery I do usually do not like bourbon because we had what was it I don't remember what it was there was um there was something I don't remember what it was it was a Christmas scent like Christmas cuddles or something like that and it had bourbon in it it was terrible it was absolutely terrible it was really really bad so that kind of took me off I was like I ain't, I ain't doing it I ain't doing it I'm not doing bourbon. But this is kind of good. This is kind of a bakery scent. Not like fruity or anything like that. But it's there. This is good. This would be good in the kitchen. Even I would use this one in the kitchen. It's not soap at all. It is completely different from the rest of them. The rest of them are very fresh, very clean, with different aspects, you know, in them. This one is completely different from the rest of them. This one, this is like a manly bakery. It is good. It is good. Jeremy did not like this one, though. He was like, mm. he didn't like this one. But it is good. It is. So vanilla bourbon. All of those scents are available in bars with sandalwood tangerine being available in the pod, in the circle, and then the Father's Day body bundle. All right. So next. Next, I have the oils because y'all know I have to get these oils. I love, I love, love, love these oils. This is practically all I use. I'll show you. I'm sitting right here. Look. This is why I put my oils in. This is the summer one. These are from Walmart that I've had for five years now. But the way you can tell, see the different size bottles? So these tall ones over here, these are a regular size oils. And then all of these little ones, they're either from these collections or um, you can buy a sampler set of the oils with the new catalog and they're in these smaller bottles. I love them. I do. I truly love these little bottles. That's all. I, that's the majority of what I use because I like that I can go through them faster. I like that it doesn't feel so daunting so I do truly I love I get them every time no matter what the collection is I always get the oil trio and then I always get the new season trio so the Father's Day oils are still available $18 for your three pack I was kind of worried I'm gonna be honest I was really worried about these because I was worried they were gonna be super piney and super woody and like mm, like Mm, I was worried so I haven't smelled them yet but I can tell you I love the top do you see the tops how they all have different like hands on them and stuff it's really neat usually they don't look like that usually it's just like 
a butterfly or like a peach I'm looking or an apple like it's usually not this is like super in-depth and very cute all right forever friend is orange meh, orange zest sweet vanilla and warm amber Mm, okay so the very first thing I smell is the orange and then it's followed by kind of like that that woodsy smell it's different it's different because it's so used to oils are usually very fruity oils are very well we just had a summer collection that was fruit of palooza they're usually like peach or they're pineapple or they're um, clean like they are this one is different this one is a unique scent because it's a very it'd be a great way to clear out you know what I mean you just use like a super fruity one let's do something completely different it's good it's better than I expected I did not have high hopes for these oils I'm always honest with you guys and I didn't I did not have high hopes for these oils but I got it because that's what I do and I was really worried about them so forever friend I smell orange first and then it is followed up by something like musky spicy woody type of thing and I think that's the amber all right next one is hero to me lime basil and geranium I feel like the geranium is going to get drowned out really quick the basil is the strong one tiny bit of lemon again totally unique scent we don't have any oils to smell like this if you are into those oils that are earthy um, the spices woodsy this is your this is your jam okay I don't hate it I don't hate it I don't smell the geranium at all basil to me is the very predominant scent in this one and then then the lemon then I smell the lemon but it's not super strong again another great scent clearing type of scent because it is so uniquely different the last one in the collection is motivator and mentor spicy black pepper lavender and cedar okay I'm kind of worried about this one I'm not gonna lie I, sm I smell the cedar I figured that would be the predominant one I don't feel like sneezing so when they say pepper is that like pepper that you would stick on your like steak pepper like I'm so confused like is that what that means why am I I should know this I shouldn't be asking you guys it's a seat it's cedar it's not like you stick your head in a cedar chest cedar but it is very earthy this one is earthy not dirt remember I have a thing where I feel like earth scent smell like dirt it doesn't smell like dirt but it definitely smells like the woods you walk through the woods and you smell the woods and some of it's a little damp not in a bad way but you know what I mean like when things are damp things smell different that's what this is again if you like earthy scents you'll want this you will 100% want these scents I was scared of them I'm not scared anymore I like them they're different like I said I think they would be a great you know you just used a great big huge fruity scent let's do something different I feel like these would be an amazing way I do feel like they'll blend well like I'm looking over my oils I feel like they're gonna blend very well with some of our winter scents you know like some of the cinnamony ones and um, what else do we do usually like clove and um, spice scents in the winter I feel like those were going to blend very well and you could almost use them as like Christmas tree scents because they're woodsy they're earthy so there you go Father's Day collection um, lightest is business casual super fresh super clean soapy type of scent but on the light aspect sandalwood and tangerine smells like cedar different completely different from the rest of them vanilla bourbon is your bakery ish type of scent in the manly collection my dear Watson is a deep sophisticated Oxford type of guy scent and route 66 is a fresh damp scent again I don't say damp is in a bad way just a damp water fresh air for real driving down the coast type of scent not the coast with like the boardwalk and touristy areas like rocky ledge type of coast not 
populated coast where it's just you smell the ocean and the rocks and the trees and the dirt it's good it's really good so there you go jeremy's pick was my dear watson and the sandalwood tangerine so if you need them let me know i've got orders going in constantly this month you guys are taking advantage of all of the sales which is wonderful the whiff box that is amazing um you guys are really loving all of these deals so if there's anything that i can help you with let me know um i'll be going live in my stories as soon as i'm done here with two more bring back my bars you guys have already seen them but in case you need a different description and then i will be back monday you guys get a break for me tomorrow i will be back monday with five more bring backs so everybody have a good rest of your weekend and i will see you guys on monday